England wearing white shirts, met Wales at Cardiff, and Ninian Park was packed with enthusiasm for the international encounter. England kicked off, but in a very short space of time it was clear that they were going to have a real job keeping the Welshmen out. Wales indeed looked very dangerous, and time and again they were within an ace of scoring. Good work by Charles playing in Ford's place eventually led to a goal by Allchurch. Bad luck followed this success. Left back Sherwood was injured and had to leave the field. Then just before half time, a free kick by England's inside right, Quicksall, was headed in by Wilshaw to equalise. In the second half, Wales were still playing with ten men, and England, who'd had the worst of the game, now went ahead. First, Wilshaw scored. Then, within a minute, Lofthouse also scored with his head. Finally, and after all its goals that count, Lofthouse got another to make it 4-1. 